Hi, I'm Karthik and this is Mastering Communications with Karthik. I'm an independent communication skills educator, a writer, author and mental health advocate. But I've been teaching communication skills to a wide variety of people for the past 10 to 11 years. This first little episode of Mastering Communication with Karthik actually delves into understanding what in today's world and scenario the meaning and the impact of communication skills is. In order to really understand communication skills, we have to view them with the lens of the current world. What is the situation that we find ourselves in? We're in a world that is highly competitive. We're in a world that is a high pressure cooker situation. Whether we talk about students at school, corporate professionals in the work realm, or even in one's personal life. Consider a few scenarios. There's a very, very brilliant, academically astute student at school, but is unable to write out his thoughts, feelings, and opinions. That amounts to nothing. All that brilliance gone waste. Similarly, in the corporate world, there may be two individuals who've been asked to present an idea. The more brilliant idea may fall completely by the wayside if that particular individual cannot make an impact through his or her presentation. Communication skills again. And like I said earlier, I go as far as to say that even in one's personal life, communication with one's partner, communication with one's family can suffer irrevocably if the person is not empathetic, if the person doesn't listen carefully, if the person is not aware and sensitive. All this comes and becomes part of the communication skills umbrella because communication skills, contrary to popular belief, it no, it's not just about writing and speaking. It's about listening carefully. It's about a heightened state of awareness. Awareness of self, awareness of another's perspective and opinion, and awareness of what's going on in the world. To add to all of this is the additional layer and complexity now of artificial intelligence. AI which is supplementing and complementing people in expressing themselves will again lead to a scenario where more and more people will sound very similar to each other. How do you break that clutter? How does that student at school, that brilliant mind, ensure that his or her brilliance is conveyed? How does that fabulous idea in the workspace translate to it being heard, listened to, register and be memorable? And how in one's personal life can a person communicate that he or she is aware, sensitive and is responding in a manner that takes into account varying perspectives? It all boils down to communication skills. And when we talk about communication skills in today's world, it therefore goes beyond the simple act of superficial and extraneous writing and speaking, because it must have components of listening, of empathy, of understanding divergence and divergent points of view, and then form a response which is unique, differentiated, personal and takes everybody along with it. I look forward to bringing you a series of episodes of this kind where we will deconstruct, simplify and demystify communication skills. We'll be coming very soon with the second episode and until then, you can catch this episode across the board on YouTube and Spotify. I'm absolutely thrilled to share with you all that I'll be teaching a very, very thorough, detailed communication skills masterclass. All these little episodes will culminate 
in a wonderful and thorough masterclass that I look forward to teaching and you can sign up for it on the CityScope app.